If you have used email before, you have probably dealt with spam in the past. Let me explain what spam is for people who are unfamiliar with email. Spam is any type of unwanted email that you receive. Normally, the messages will be sent automatically from unknown businesses, and you will not be able to stop the messages from being sent. It's much like getting a bunch of ads in your home mailbox that you don't want. But luckily with email, we can automatically filter it. We will start with how to prevent spam first before we show you how to stop spam from showing up in your inbox. The first tip to prevent spam is to have multiple email addresses. I always recommend that you have at least two, one for junk and one for personal. If you need one for work, I would also recommend that you have one more for just that. Use the junk email account to put on anything that you know you will receive spam from. Companies nowadays know that all they have to do is get your email address and they have access to unlimited free advertising. Also, use the junk mail account for anything that you place online in a public area where others can see it. There are programs out there that will scan websites for anything that resembles an email address and save it to their database. If you have to type in your email address in a public place, then try to disguise it by doing something like this. Another tip is to never respond to spam. By responding to it, you are letting the sender know that you are in fact receiving the emails and most likely they will just keep sending you more. Also, make sure that when you enter your email address online, that you uncheck to send special offers if you do not want to receive them. Now let's take a look at how to change some settings on our email client to help filter out some of the junk mail. To change the junk mail settings on Windows Live Mail, click the blue tab at the top and hover over the options. Then click on the safety option. In here is where we can adjust the level of filtering for our junk mail. You can switch these settings to see what you like best. Mine is set to high, which I will leave because Live Mail does a pretty good job at filtering out the right emails. Something to remember is to check your junk mail folder before you delete all the messages that are in there. Sometimes emails that are not spam will get filtered into the spam folder by accident. In the next chapter, we will learn how to use music, photos, and videos with Windows Media Player.